Hello friends and welcome. I'm Shaiku and this is I'm a, a guest starring on Lag. After Yay! dark. Yay! After dark. <laughs> I After I've, dark. I've warned my way into another uh, one of my friends Will series. You let, him, let him come back. <laughs> so um, we are just about to do the movie shoot? challenge. Yeah, so uh, so we all pick a movie and it'll give us a prompt afterwards and we'll have to discuss who's Movie based with that prompt is the best, I think. Got it. Okay. okay. Aye, aye, Captain. So, uh, uh, my movie, I'll pick seven. Oh, that's oh, a good movie. God. So everybody choose a movie, say your choice out loud to the rest of the players before clicking. Okay, so you, Bellman, you have to choose a movie. Man, so you chose seven? Yeah. Okay. Uh, just pick a new a movie? Any movie. We won't Any? know what the, like, the prompt is afterwards. So I'm gonna pick the Goonies. Oh, that's good. Uh, Rocky Horror. Fuck! Picture show. Really? That was mine. <laughs> that was mine, actually. I'll do the Royal Ten of Moms. Okay. Alright. We're ready all. Who wins? I, uh... Player order decided on how weird the fandom of selected movie would be. Oh, Rocky Horror. Yeah, I yeah, that's... <laughs> I so, along with me for okay. So who would who's, who would be next though? Maybe. Huh. What was your spell win? The, the Goonies. Oh, that's not, not weird. weird. It's it's wholesome. Wholesome. I feel like all the like but, but how fans. weird would people? Oh. Um, people would. I mean, I think seven, seven is pretty yeah, pretty fucked up. I, I, I'd say seven. People in the no, seven. Say, people in the seven fandom are actual serial maybe, killers. Probably, maybe, no, probably I'd say Alan went first. Shaiku second. No, Sarah Cat third. No, no, no you would. Your movie think, is more mainstream than my movie. I yeah, but it says think, how, on on how weird the fandom. I don't think you yeah, know, no, like, no, would be weird. Not unless we have pedophiles that are like, yeah, Goonies. Ah. Like, yeah, so um, I think Bella would get yeah. a fourth, but yeah. that's totally okay. Yeah, I get fourth. Yeah, I don't think you know, like nobody's drawing fan art of uh, what's his face the. Top, oh, there you go. <laughs> <guys. laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, so. Alonwin, you are you're up first. Why? Uh, Alonwin is. What happens? Oh, are we in the lunchroom? Oh, so you God. get to you get to pick uh, who you want to sit with. Oh my God. Oh, okay. Oh, so many choices. Okay, okay, so I will say the 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 cat in the middle there, she runs a shop, so you can spend your money. So but that'll oh. take your whole like turn. You won't get to hang out with anyone. Oh. Okay. Um. What does she sell? S I don't. I don't really understand. Like, I don't know that much about this. <laughs> uh, okay. I just know she sells. I might. I'm gonna hang out. Well, the red people are over here, nice and segregated. <laughs> so. Oh my god. <laughs> I'll join them. You come upon Damien. Wow. Searing <laughs> <laughs> at Randa's elaborate silverware spread while her eating serves chow down obediently at a neighboring table. I still don't get why you collect all of these stupid forks and spoons and shit. <laughs> I mean, even the knives don't really look that deadly. <laughs> Silly boy. It, Jesus, this is <laughs> not for <laughs> killing. <laughs> Things can be for stuff other than killing? That's lame as hell. <laughs> it's basically useless. I mean, you don't even eat. Your serfs do it for you. That's why she's such a skinny bitch. <laughs> Jesus, well, of course they do. But they're not using any of your silverware. Naturally, they aren't. Serfs must eat with their hands, as befits the lower classes. This is my table, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> so you're saying the silverware collection has no practical purpose? Things have practical purposes? Oh my god. These two could go round and round like this forever, unless you say something to resolve the dispute. Damien's right. Mary? Mary. Murray. <laughs> Bill Murray. Maybe, <laughs> Bill, maybe it is time you started murdering people with your silverware. Lay off Miranda, Damien. Oh, lay off Miranda, Damien. Oh what about God. your collection of exotic corpses? <laughs> hmm. So you, you pick who you like more, I guess. I think... I think she Who should Who are you people. boning after prom? I'm going... what I'm taking out of this. I, All right, they're so both... Can, Cute. She looks like Starfire. I'm gonna go with Damien though. One heart. I mean, I was just giving her shit, but I am in favor of any plan that gets more people murdered. How barbaric. Are you sure that's the right thing to do? Yep. 100% <laughs> absolutely. Well, alright then. Yum, yum, Daisy. Take the sharpest. Oh, it's its name. Take the sharpest of these silvered wares of your filthy peasant hands and go a-murdering, would you? 
I was kind of hoping you would do the murdering yourself. If we're living in an age wherein a lady can't outsource her senseless murders to her servants, I don't know what the world is coming to. Fair enough, as long as the murders get done, I guess I don't care. Miranda <laughs> even outsources some silverware murder to you. And Damien, as a team, it really brings you closer to each other. Oh. So murder, yes. Shaiku! Alright, um... That was not what I was expecting. <laughs> So, I don't, I don't can we all go after, like, if we were all like, oh, yeah, Damien, yeah. Do we all, could we all go sit? Oh, wait, no, no, only so one we, other person So we can't sit, sit there. The, yeah, but we can, uh, this I think. This table is filled. There'll be times for us to screw other people over. I don't know. Screw I other people. <laughs> oh. <God>. Yeah. <laughs> there's a, there's a comma in there. Gotcha. Um, I know that here, I guess. Sit down with Zoe and Scott. Scott is eating, eating his trademark pizza sandwich, which is just three slices of pizza on top of each oh, other. Oh, sounds delicious. <laughs> That's a, yeah, yeah. Guy after my Sign me up. Yeah. Zoe has a notebook out and is making, is taking notes. But how do you get your food, Scott? Why do you want to know so bad? It's pretty normal. No, it can't be normal. I'm doing research for my latest fanfic. Cry havoc and let slips the dogs of love. <laughs> <laughs> It's about a pack of werewolves <laughs> going on the biggest hunt of their lives. A hunt that will change them as hunters and also as werepeople. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. <laughs> they went looking for food, but what they found was personal growth and a new understanding of group sexual <laughs> She does have those tendrils. Yeah, like like all good fanfics turn into. <laughs> also food. <laughs> that's, that's why you know. How do you hunt? Oh, well normally I go to the cafeteria and I ask for pizza. <laughs> Say we're all hunting in a pack, enjoying the spoils together in a feast of blood and rage, exploring each other's bodies. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess sometimes me and my cousins order a pizza at home, and then the pizza comes and we eat the pizza. <laughs> How tame! <laughs> God, Scott, you dense fuck! <laughs> so he's not looking at all satisfied with Scott's answer. Maybe you can get Scott to give it some juicier information info. Or convince Zoe that ordering pizza is actually dramatic. I thought it said romantic, and I was like, <clears throat> I don't think so. Sky, what about when you go searching for pizza in the wild? <laughs> <laughs> so we don't dismiss the other suspense and extreme, extreme pathos of waiting endlessly for pizza to arrive. Truly, it is the central tra tragedy of the 21st century. <laughs> waiting for pizza, first world problem. Yeah, like when. So pizza... who do you like here, Shaiku? Um, I don't know, like, uh, I mean, they're both pretty. Sky's pretty hunky, <laughs> but. Uh, <laughs> I, I like me some uh, some eldritch beings from beyond like the stars. Some tendrils. Yeah. Get those tentacles in there. <laughs> oh man, we did that one time and it was the worst. <laughs> there was no cell phone service, so instead of calling for delivery, we had to transfer into wolves and chase it down. <laughs> and then when we got there, it wasn't even pizza, it was 3D. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't any bread or cheese, so instead of bread, we used deer flesh. Instead of cheese, we used more deer flesh. <laughs> and instead of pepperoni, we used. Deer flesh? No, beef jerky. We're not animals. <laughs> oh, I think you are, Scott. I think you are. And now, how do you all sleep on your little camping trip? In a nude or nude cuddling? <laughs> <laughs> Looks like the conversation is finally giving the way Zoe wanted it to. She shoots you an appreciative wink with one of the light devouring boys that passed for her eyes. So are you just oh. smash oh. making them? Smash both. I don't know. <laughs> Mr. Yeah, Sarah can, can I get into it? Yeah, here you go. Where are you gonna sit? Why can't we all sit together? Because we're trying to smash other people, not each other. <laughs> you find Polly and Liam not eating as usual, you know, because they're undead. You know, the food in this cafeteria really is atrocious. It's hardly even worthy of my Instagram. Haha, <laughs> 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 what? I don't even eat the food. See, this is exactly what I mean. We can do so much better than these subpar culinary abortions. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I see what you mean. You mean the two of us should have a cook-off? What? No! <laughs> Did you say something? I'm not listening because I'm so psyched about this cook-off. <laughs> At no point did I agree to. I've got a huge advantage though because I've cooked so many drugs. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you think you've got the advantage, huh? I've been alive for centuries of culinary history. It's on. <laughs> it's on. <laughs> the two of them dash into the kitchen, ignoring all rules of law, school, and common decency as they commence cooking. The two celebrity chef judges appear to be <laughs> challengers. <laughs> I think they're both equally horrible, says the cruel British judge. I did not say that in a British accent. 
I think they're both equally marvelous, says the other nice British judge. Both judges turn to you. What do you think, tiebreaker judge, whose meal truly is the cat's pajamas? Cat's pajamas. <laughs> Liam's, because I think that glass jar of fresh human blood really goes with the parsley he sprinkled on top. Hey, it's a parsley. Holly, because she literally <laughs> just made a pair of pajamas for a cat. <laughs> what? Unbelievable. That's not even food. What isn't even food? The pile of yarn you're knitting in the frying pan. <laughs> Put a set of pajamas for a cat. Oh. Was it supposed to be food? Sorry, I forgot what we were doing. Yes, it's supposed to be food, and yours obviously isn't. Oh yeah, then how come the, I won the food contest, huh? Well, because... Yeah, that's what I thought. Bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I'll catch y'all later. I gotta find a cat to put these pajamas on. Later, you run into Polly again, and she lets you pet her kitty, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Damn, Damn it! Bad. Bad. <laughs> It means you get to pet the cat and she put pajamas on. What'd you think it meant? Oh, oh, oh god! god. <laughs> Alright, Miss Bellowin. Alright, so I have already conversed with this computer man and we're gonna get our wires crossed, if you know what I mean. Hey, <laughs> hey. <laughs> oh, god. Please, hold on. I, I know, I'm gonna sit right next to them. Vera is spending her lunch period scheming as usual. Calcul- Oh, his name is just so <laughs> molesty. Yeah. <laughs> just Calculator <laughs> looks on in a mechanical approximation of dismay. Now, if I can just get the poison into the next shipment of cafeteria food, the starving students will be forced to pay me inflated prices for my authentic food flakes. <laughs> Vera, no, do not do this. I mean, look at his body. Why? Have you determined that is unprofitable? No. Smiley. Happy. Are you looking for a cut? Negative. <laughs> Are you a Robocop? <laughs> you have to tell me if you're a Robocop. I am not a law officer, but you are- but what you are planning to do is wrong. Hmm. Agree to disagree. Error. Cannot comply with internally contradictory instructions. Meltdown. <laughs> Meltdown. Oh no, you gotta save him. Uh oh, this could get ugly. You need to chill Calculester out or convince Vera to change her ways. Okay, don't worry, Cal. Vera is just being helpful. Sure, the poison may kill some people, but those who survive will be more resistant to poison in the future. Or whatever. He's right, Vera. I mean, you did. Did you even check to see if your poison is vegan friendly? <laughs> I mean, I'm I'm totally going with going, going Calcium out. Lester. Yeah, Calcium Lester. My God, you're right. My go-to poison uses uses. Bacillus. Bacillus. Oh my God, my brain just stopped. <laughs> Error. <laughs> As a base, it's good for routine political assassinations and killing people who disagree with me. But for a mass operation like this. The Basilisk right? Activists will be up in arms, and some of them have a lot of arms because they're octopi. <laughs> oh well, back to the drawing board. Looks like I'll have to find a plant-based poison to work with. Analysis! <laughs> Friend is still attempting an unethical plan, but on a longer time scale and with animal-friendly ingredients. <laughs> I accept this marginal improvement. Bellowin, you are technically a good person. Technically. That's all I strive for. Oh, he likes you, probably. Oh, they got your first like? Let's trade places. Everybody chooses a TV show. Say your choice out loud to the rest of the players before clicking. A TV show. Buffy. Sherlock. Avatar The Last Airbender. I'll go with One Piece. Ah. Okay. Player orders decided based on how funny and wrong it would be if anthropologists from 500 years in the future had to guess how life was nowadays based solely on watching this TV show. Hmm. How funny and wrong? Uh, oh, well, <laughs> I would say <laughs> like if they were on the set of whichever show we picked and they're like this. You know is like how uh what is it uh What's the movie with Tim Allen and they're in space? Lost in space. No, uh, Gal no, <laughs> Galaxy Quest. Oh yeah. And they like the the whole their whole civilization based everything like on Earth like Star Trek. Mm, films. Yes. So okay. So if, if I mean, that happened, Buffy funny would be and wrong cool because it'd be wrong. They'd be like, oh my god, the sixteen year old killed everybody. So. so uh, I think me and. Uh, I think Shaku's number I one. Yeah. I think. Okay. 
Avatar would be people, Avatar people is number two. People I think Bumpy's number flat. three, and I think I'm last. Because we again. picked cartoons. Yeah, we did pick cartoons. All right. So also, the anime people. They were like, "Oh my you, god, they look like cartoons." But humans, the fighting humans styles used to have, are inspired by like real life martial arts. Humans so. used to have like eyes half the size of their faces. <laughs> yeah. All right, you're the leader of Lang. Choose the places. Thank you, Sarah Cat, Mr. Sarah Cat. All right, I truly think Shaiku's number one. Yes. Are we in agreement? Yeah. Yes. Second place, I do think it's a lawn win. I would, yeah, I'll agree with that. What do you yes. think, Sarah Cat? Sure. Thank you. I think Sarah Cat's number three. Mr. Sarah Cat. Sorry, you know, <laughs> sorry, wrong pronoun. And I'm number four. What did you choose? She's number three. And oh, I'm you chose Sherlock. Yeah, because I like the little baby is going to be their god in the future. Wait, this is right. still only week one? How many weeks is it nighttime? There? There's, there's two weeks. Oh, it's oh, the evening. Okay. It's, we're almost, it's evening time. No, we're almost halfway there. See, week look, we got. Evening. We're like on day three of. Okay. Seven. Uh, okay. okay. Um, we can I, go to I suck a, a lot of stuff. I'll, uh, I'm gonna do both this. Bathroom? Ew. That day you skipped class just to hang out in the bathrooms because you respect no authority. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> I guess some people just want to watch the world burn. <laughs> By skipping class and hanging out in the bathrooms. Thanks for clarifying. <laughs> yes. You get zero shits, but that game gets <laughs> two full <laughs> Polly is there too, doing her best to perfect that delicate art form. The bathroom selfie. <laughs> hey, she's mine! Oh! Back to football! Oh. Uh oh! Mr. Oh, I am looking so good today, and it's like a crime. <laughs> I did not should be arrested. <laughs> but I can't post any of these devastating selfies yet. They're missing the most important ingredient. That's right, a killer selfie sticker. We've got so many, and they're all so good. Which one should I use? What? Dance monkey. <laughs> <laughs> Remember your race. Two faces is twice as nice. Um, uh, okay, so this is back to she might like one more than the other, right? Yeah, okay. which... Gosh. Dance monkey. I, I think I have to go dance. Oh, oh my, oh my god. god, shut up. I love dance monkey. <laughs> dance monkey, the monkey who dances. International sensation. You if she me. leaves me for you, I will Ooh. fucking cut you. <laughs> Are you telling me they have the official Dance Monkey Dance Team Limited Edition selfie sticker? The one where you can see Dance Monkey's entire red ass? <laughs> <laughs> send it to me, send it to me now. I'm gonna make him rub his ass on my face. <laughs> Cheek to cheek. Oh my oh, god! She is into it. You are delighted. <laughs> <laughs> You're not finding someone else is into dance monkey as you are. You're getting too trauma with them. Alright, children of life, please step away from the <laughs> computer <laughs> screen. Yeah, there's gonna be okay. like a, a throwdown wrestling match between <laughs> Sarah Cat and Shaiku, and I will commentary the Mr. shit. Out Sarah okay, Cat. I need to go. Where have we not gone? We can go wherever you want. Shaiku went over there. I might go to. What's the auditorium gonna do for me? Uh, right creativity, trigger. I think. Right trigger. Right trigger. Oh, what's the smiley, happy? That's, uh, that's, the purple one's creativity. I'm actually gonna go to the library, I think. Nerd. You are just jealous. <laughs> that day you spend some time in the library's PCs playing some good old online poker. Gambling seems like a stupid and dangerous decision. But who cares? This time it paid off, so fuck it. <laughs> I gained two money. Nice. <laughs> That's right. You were going to help Zoe with her match or fuck math homework <laughs> after not her English homework. <laughs> We've had a couple drinks. So. But you notice her surrounded by a crowd of sinister cloaked figures. Ooh. She seems pissed about it. Guys, stop it. I don't want any dead goats. I'm at school. <laughs> <laughs> ah, we understand you perfectly, Lord Zagord. This is a test. We must bring you even more dead goats to satisfy you, your dark hunger. What? No, that's the opposite of what I said. I don't go by Zagord anymore. I'm Zoe, okay? Z-O-E. Can we take a rain check on that study session alignment? I can't stand to be around these jerks. Zoe brushes past you on her way out. The cultists stare at you with unconcealed awe. Well, okay, it's concealed by their terrifying masks, but still. Zagord addressed you by name, and you did not go mad with pleasure. <laughs> oh, <laughs> man. It addressed you almost as if you were an equal. It passed without 
within inches of your frail mortal frame. And what's more, it mentioned rain. Could it be that it was referring to the fabled storm of cerebrospinal fluid, which will one day come to quench all sanity? Oh, my oh goodness. wow. <laughs> Brother, sisters, bow down before... Al That's fucking right. Oh, bow wow. down before a lawn, which is clearly the prophet <laughs> She's of She's getting Zagorn. a big ego. <laughs> Please, O oh Prophet, guide our worship, for we have noticed of late that our Lord appears dissatisfied with our sacrifices. The blood of many goats <laughs> once pleased the Lord, and yet now we do not understand what has changed. That's pretty obvious. <laughs> Perhaps, given your special relationship with our incomprehensible master, you could suggest a new sort of sacrifice that would please it. F fuck it till you get me. You got nothing better to do, you decide to be a prophet for the day, you tell them that what they should really be sacrificing. It's important to learn from your mistakes, so sacrifice another goat, but right, we're sorry on the side. <laughs> sacrifice your own harmful prejudices. That, that so me. is this gonna please Zoe? Zoe's uh, I, think so. I know. Well, maybe. Oh my God, new characters in the game. Who am I smashing? Okay. You're all three. I want to <laughs> sacrifice your own harmful prejudices. Oh fuck, I messed uh -oh. up. Of course our own harm harmful prejudices. We're in the body of those located. Again. You try to explain that you were being metaphorical, but they were too busy discussing amongst themselves. Ah the uh, yes, and the pancreas. <laughs> 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 sacrificial scalpels. You've never watched a crowd of people cheerfully disembowel themselves. Oh before. god. It's bad. <laughs> oh fuck, she's uh -oh. not gonna like me. <laughs> Quick, comrade, shower our dark master with proof of our ultimate sacrifice. Oh, God. Stop <laughs> throwing your pancreases at me. Not cool. But it's too late. The cultists are all dead now because cutting out your own pancreas is not healthy. I didn't even get to it. That was a hard one. Uh, I know. Right, like, that was tough. Group. Right mid. Cultists died of misguided organ loss. This is not how I want my life to be anymore. This is so depressing. Oh, God, I ruined everything. I'm going to go stare into the void until it stops staring back. Oh, that's aggressive. Fuck. <laughs> I'm I was going to clean up all these dead bodies. I lose two bullets. I'm back to not being fun. Well, yeah, you killed everybody. Oh, I yeah. ruined everything. It's a shame you can't just smash the narrator. I'm s Wait, can you not go outside? He can go outside. outside. Yeah. Well, it says outdoors is available. Okay. Stranger. Welcome to my little shop. Buy some shit. I have the shit that will boost your sense. Shit that will lead you to stupid new adventures. Even some shit that might be much needed. It's a very specific moment, so take a look. I didn't Ooh. want to shop, but okay. Um, a gift, a motivational poster, a Bob Ross. Ow! A Bob Ross. <laughs> ah! I don't want to use tampon. Uh, yeah, you know what I would use that for. <laughs> they aren't cool anymore. Hype, hype, hype. I don't want a PR agent. Uh, I don't know what I want. That is such a such a punk cat. Right? I really like her. Cute. You want a fake badass tattoo? Mm. You should plus 9,000 to your street cred. Plus 9,000! Uh. <laughs> no refunds. Just that water. That snake face. <laughs> that, that was my turn? Yeah. Ah! I forgot. All right, Bellowin. All right, so, uh, let's, let's see. You're over there. You're over there. You're over there. I think. Yeah. Outside class or the auditorium? Might go, should I go tree or auditorium? I might go over here. Go for it. Wait, what does this do? That's uh, creativity. Creativity? How creative am I? How do you know You're that? not. <laughs> Actually, looking at my creativity, I'm kind of mid. Wait, what are we pointing at? Actually, I want to be more charming. You're green, okay. so your creativity is eight. No, she's blue. No, Sarah Cats. Yeah, I know. Sarah how do you Cat. know that it's going to raise your creativity? Because the little smiley face corresponds to different things. Mm. Oh. I might just go over here. That day while rehearsing for the class play, you are struck by the lightning of inspiration. No, actually struck by lightning, you're dead. <laughs> I know, that's what I thought. You lose. No, she's, she's, a, she's a Frankenstein, she's fine. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you come up with the ultimate nickname for yourself. You tell everyone to call you by it. Uh, also known as one of the seven most douchebaggish moves <laughs> in the world. But the nickname is so awesome and inventive and appropriate that people decide to go with it. 
quite a feat. You gain plus two creativity. What's the nickname? We, the devs, dare you to actually come up with a nickname for yourself and ask the other players to call you by that name until the end of this run. All right, Rowan. Right. Um, What's your nickname? Oh, 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 oh it's my man! Oh, no, okay. you have to call that the nickname okay, first. I want you to call me, um, uh, hold on. I'm open to suggestions as well. No. Okay. You came up with it yourself. <laughs> you have to call me when he said that. You have to say, my lord. My lord. My Don't look at me like that, Sarah Cat! My lord, Mr. Sarah Cat! No, just my lord. Even though I'm. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna do it. Well, you have to. No, they're supposed to be cool enough that Shai we want to call you. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Shaiku said. Well, yes. go, go talk to your I you Lester. Gonna, I thought you, one of you were gonna go with, like, Big Pop. Like, you... Oh my god! <laughs> okay, um. You can't yeah. go back, my lord. <laughs> no. Yeah, Big you Papa. You dug this grave? No, it's my lord. But I like when you call me Big Papa. <laughs> well, we're not. Well, go talk to Calcumo. Okay, my lord. <laughs> okay, either is fine. I have two. And it looks like Calculus is off by himself again, working on his virtual reality. Uh-huh. <laughs> you don't know how he's able to sh shirk so many school responsibilities to work on this project. Then again, you shirk responsibilities all the time to try to fuck your classmates. <laughs> 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 As you approach, you notice the air around him is several degrees warmer than usual. He must be pretty worried about something. Oh! Oh my god! Does he look different? He it's, looks it's, different! He's it's, it's lost him. Oh, he's in his... It's in his costume because you're is, at the theater. Oh, he's like a different though, and I'm worried about something. I imagine he sounds like Hal. Um, <laughs> nailed it. <laughs> All was progressing well enough in my virtual world. Intelligent life evolved, developed language and society, and kept senseless violence within standard parameters. <laughs> it was going so well, in fact, that I decided to enter the reality myself to conduct a UX poll. Instead of providing me useful feedback, however, the citizens of my reality provided me with dead goats. <laughs> Why do they hate goats? Man, I don't know. Yeah, Why do they hate goats? Yeah, <laughs> apparently, a goat. apparently, as their creator, I command a certain and unanticipated level of awe and respect. I am embarrassingly enough a god to them. <laughs> they have since. What? <laughs> Oops. <laughs> they have since designated the day of my appearance as a holy day, constructed an enormous. And upsetting? I was gonna say upsetting phallic. Phallic. <laughs> tower on the spot and are currently murdering each other for control of said tower. Of said penis tower. <laughs> Senseless violence has spiked well outside the acceptable range. And now instead of improving their virtual society, the people are spending all their time on my dick. Sorry. <laughs> I'm putting my face on various merchandise and co-opting popular music genres to sing my praises. I must devise a way to cure them of this unhealthy obsession. Then I tried telling them to stop. All it did was spark a, a holy war. What to do? Oh man. Oh, calculus, I really want you to like me. Involve your highest rank worshippers in a controversial scandal with. <laughs> oh my god! That. Okay, produce a little crumpy. Uh, a what? what? He's a philosopher. Mm hmm. Not only do I not know how to say that word. Nishi? Nishi. 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 Oh my god. Netch. Natch. <laughs> you see Natch. Okay, I'm gonna go with this one. This one's awful. Well, that's real my life. My lord. Sir. Sarah Cat. <laughs> Mr. Hello. Sarah Cat. Please like me. Calculus sir. It's just a scam. Yes! Yes! Ooh. He loves me! Okay, of you course. answer that. <laughs> of course, I understand your meaning precisely. I feel bad for the virtual <laughs> children, but this ha but this has to be done. <laughs> there, I have altered reality so that the leader of the leaders of my worship no! are secretly Did you hear him? Babies wearing old people's skin. No one will trust them now. You've got to admit, that's way better than what you were imagining. <laughs> you have to enter Calculus's reality briefly to broker a treaty with the newly created hyper-intelligent babies. But hey, you're down to enter anything that involves Calculus. <laughs> Am I right? Am I right? You gain plus two smarts and one charm. Uh-oh. Do I? Oh. Yes! Oh, Wait, I hope it's good. Is Ow. it good? Something Please. happened to you a lot of a long oh, way. oh, weekend times me party all day, um, but I guess I'd like to see what happens here in the next round, so we'll see that what so happens. That was so smooth. That was a great <laughs> transition. Uh, on the uh, next by, by the way, next time I'm lag. 